Hey guys, what's up? I hope you're all doing well. Today we're doing another welded it tutorial. And in today's video, I will be showing you guys how to make your own custom trees. Yeah, so I'll be showing you guys how to make an oak tree, a custom birch tree, and a custom spruce tree. If there's any other trees that you would like me to build in another episode, then just leave them down in the comments and I uh, might do another episode. Anyway, here are the timestamps. If you want to skip to a specific tree, there will also be a pinned comment with the timestamps that you can just click. Anyway, let's get started. So um, uh, these are very simple trees. I'm not a very good builder myself, so I'm, I'm pretty sure that some of you guys might be able to do it much better. But this is uh, my take on it. Let's start with the oak tree. So first off, we are going to pick up some sponge. This is just the block that I like to use. You can use whatever you want to. Um, it's just a block that we're going to replace later. So right now we'll just build something that indicates how tall the tree is going to be. And then we'll build some kind of foot for our tree. Just like that. Um, it's a little random. Uh, the more random you make it, the more natural it looks. Pretty much. That's probably fine. Then we need some big branches. And I just like to make it a little bit random. Just spam some blocks. Kind of like sideways and up. You're not really going to see most of these. Because the leaves will cover them. That might actually be about perfect. So just like this. And now we'll do slash slash wand and get ourselves the want and then we'll just do a selection I'm just gonna do a slash slash pass two for this one then do another two slashes and replace sponge of course with oak wood so now we have that then I'm just gonna take some random item I like to use a stick and apply a brush to that. So two slashes, brush, and then sphere. And then we want to do oak, leaves. Then we want to make them persistent. So we want to set persistent to true. Then we do comma and air. And let's just do it, I don't know, like three probably. And another important thing is another two slashes, G mask, air. So now it doesn't replace any blocks other than air. And now we can just right click wherever we want our leaves. Uh, it's pretty simple. Just right click in places. It actually already looks pretty good. Um, we could just use an, an, a smaller brush. Maybe put a bit more on top here. That's actually pretty much it. You can of course place some stuff in by hand just to make it look a bit better um you you almost can't avoid editing some stuff by hand after that's just something you have to to do in order to make it look good but i'll say it's a it's a pretty good looking tree you're not gonna lie all right let's move on to the next one so the next one is our birch tree we're gonna pick up our sponge again and start placing Let's make it like this tall. And the birch tree is going to be a bit thinner. So the, the foot is not going to be as thick as the oak tree. Just pretty much like that. And then we'll make some branches. Some very um, thin and like upwards branches. And also not too many. Just like two of those, probably. Then we'll get our wand. Or you can also do the commands, of course. Slash, slash, pause two or one. And then replace the sponge with birch wood, of course. Oh yeah, 
Uh, when you want to replace stuff, you have to have your mask disabled. So just do slash slash mask to disable that. And then let's try again. And there we go. Now we're going to use our brush again. But this time we're going to do a brush that is birch leaves, of course. And remember to set the persistent to true and add air. And then I'm going to do a three. And also remember to do your G mask air. Then I'm just going to place one in the middle like this. And then I'm going to make a new one that's only two. And just on top like that. And that's all I'm going to use the brush for. You can see it already looks pretty good. But I'm going to edit some stuff by hand. So just place like blocks wherever it looks good. It's pretty much whatever you feel like. Just looking around it. And um, try to make it a little bit pointier. Um, and also a little bit random. Random leaves looks the best. Alright, that is actually pretty much it for the birch tree. Maybe it's a little bit too pointy, I don't know, but um, but I think it's a, this is a pretty good one. So let's move on to the spruce tree. Now for the spruce tree, I'm going to use sponge again. I'm going to make the same one like this. I'm going to make this a little bit taller. And for this one, I'm going to make the foot much thicker. Not too thick, though. Mm, is that about it? Nah, let's do a little bit more. Like, when you're building trees, it's mostly about, like, what you feel looks good in the moment. Um, yeah, that, that's pretty good. And then for the spruce tree, the branches are much bigger. So I'm just gonna build them like this. I'm honestly, I'm not a big fan of uh, the way I build spruce trees. I'm not gonna lie. I, uh, but uh, I'm, I mean, it's, it's okay. Uh, it's okay. You can also remove this if you wanna. Um, let's make one. Nah, 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 nah. And one here as well. Maybe. Just like that. Just do it a bit random. And then as you go further up, they should be a bit shorter and smaller. Just like that. And I'm just going to make it just a little bit taller so we have a bit more space for for more branches. And then at the very top, you're just going to make... I'm just going to make some of those. Maybe a bit lower, actually. And that's pretty much it. You select the area. As with all the others, you replace... The sponge with spruce wood. I forgot the G mask again, of course. There we go. For this tree, I actually don't use the brush tool at all. Um, I just hand place all the leaves. So what you're going to do is you're going to just place leaves on top of these and kind of around it as such. And you can also make it a little bit like this if you want it to like go down. Also do some some random random leaves here. You can make it like hang hang down from it. Like this. Yeah. 
You know, you, you can make this in, in many different ways. You don't necessarily have to make these hanging uh, vines or leaves or whatever you want to call it. Um, this is something I like to do. And yeah, just keep placing a little bit random leaves. Remember to sometimes go out here and look at the whole thing. Um, if you're just too close all the time, then you might not see the bigger picture. And it might end up being a bit off. Maybe even ugly if you're unlucky. <laughs> all right, and as we get to the top, branches get smaller and at the very top here we're just gonna make a little tall one there and then just some some vines going off or some uh, some leaves going off these kind of hanging down maybe try to place it a little bit random I think that is about it. So yeah, that is my spruce tree. All right, that wraps up today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. And if you aren't already, please subscribe. It means a lot. And yeah, there's nothing more to say. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye.